Today, the Western Australian Minister for Water announced that groundwater replenishment will be the next new water source for Perth. Groundwater replenishment takes highly treated wastewater from the Water Corporation's wastewater treatment plant. This water is already 99.99% water and is piped to our advanced water recycling plant. We use three different tried and tested water treatment methods to treat it to drinking water quality. Ultrafiltration separates out any dissolved materials that are larger than one three hundredth the width of a human hair. Next, through a process of reverse osmosis, water molecules pass through tiny pores 100 times smaller than ultrafiltration, leaving other dissolved materials behind. And finally, the water is subjected to ultraviolet light to destroy any trace levels of microorganisms that may remain. The water goes through multiple checks along the way to ensure it's been fully cleaned and meets Australian guidelines for drinking water. It's then recharged deep into the groundwater aquifer where it's stored or banked for later use as a drinking water source. The water moves slowly through the aquifer and is expected to remain there for decades. It will eventually be drawn up from the ground through our normal groundwater bores. It will then be tested and treated again using our normal water treatment processes, which include aeration, filtration and chlorination. It's a very exciting day today. We're here to announce $116 million towards a commercial groundwater replenishment project which will deliver seven gigalitres of water into the Perth interconnected system. I'm very confident that the science behind this process, injecting water into the ground, it stays in there for a number of decades before it's drawn out, treated again and goes into our drinking water system, will help to drought proof Perth supply and support the economic development of Western Australia. Groundwater replenishment will now be a new climate independent drinking water source for Perth.